Hi everyone, welcome back. I have a very large bag from Hobonichi here and it's a very flat bag as well and um, if you're keen I'm sure you know why, what that means. Um, but I was open here it says, let's see, can I? Oh I can, excellent. Um, I entered into the lottery to be able to purchase one of the limited edition products from the 2022 range and I was lucky enough to win it. So let's see what's in the bag. Oh it's a bag. Oh I didn't expect it to come in a canvas bag as well. It's, that's awesome. Alright I think if you know me well you're probably going to know what's in here. Oh but look how pretty it is. It's all nicely packaged. Okay, let's open it up. I just this bow is just so beautifully done. I don't want to open it, but obviously I'm opening it. Oh, cool! And I'll get an extra bag to put things in. Okay, here we go. Oh my goodness! Look at it. It seems even pinker. Oh, it's gorgeous. Oh my goodness. Okay, so this is the Malia Kent Rose Tweed Tote Bag. Um, there was only a small number of these made, and so they had to do like a what they call a lottery in order to be able to um, purchase it. And I think I think they made quite a few, um, but still, to be able to get one. Oh, I'm so excited! Look how pretty this is. Okay, so I do happen to have the planner here for you to compare it to. And see what I mean? I think it is a teensy bit pinker. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's not. Maybe it's just because this is stretched onto the backing. Um, oh, I love it. It's just gorgeous. Um, okay, let's let's look at the bag. All right, so we have the beautiful tweed, with the, which has the same as the planner, the pink, the blue, the cream, the pale pink, and the gold. And hopefully you can see that gold sparkle there. It's just stunning. Um, it is just a square bag. It has no bottom in it. It doesn't have a, you know, it's not gusseted in any way. It's just stitched. And you can see at the top here it has leather um, eyelets put in it. which And that has the cord through to close the bag. Um, this one has like a handle part here, I guess, this thicker part. We'll see how that works. I have a bit of an idea of what that's for, which I'll talk about in a minute. Oh, it's gorgeous. I can't see anything wrong. There's no pulled fabric or anything, pulled threads or anything. It's just gorgeous. Um, obviously, this isn't going to be an everyday bag because it's probably going to get damaged if I did use it for every day, even though I'd love to just take it with me everywhere. Uh, I'll see. Let's see how we go. So, it could go over your wrist here like this. Okay, so I think what this part here is for is to be a complete um, handle, if you like. So, you can pull this all the way through, and then you'll have yourself a single handle, and then you can gather this all up so that... Let's do it, actually. I wasn't going to because I was kind of keen to not um, gather it just yet, but I, until I show you the inside. But see, if you gather that all together, it becomes this cute little bag. And then you have this long shoulder strap that can actually go well over your shoulder. And, and it brings it closed as well. So I think that is a really neat little way of doing it. So, let me put it back to how it was. If I can. Okay, so that's our little bag. Let's have a look inside. Okay, so you can see, hopefully... Inside it's lined with a pink kind of satiny material, very pale pink, and it's beautiful. <laughs> uh, lined all the way through, um, has a little desiccating pocket in there, I'll leave it in there for now. It has the little Hobonichi name tag, uh, just like in the planners, just there. And it has a pocket here. Let's see, I have my iPhone 13 Pro Max, and that fits in there. It sticks out the top a little, but it does fit in there. Uh, Width-wise, at least, quite nicely, and then when it's drawn closed, it'll still be within within the bag. So I don't have my big ruler with me. I only have my little tiny one, <laughs> but I can give you an idea of the dimensions. That's so about twenty. It's about twenty-six centimeters this way, 
and probably about 35 I guess let me see 15 about 29 high so it's a bit more than square so it's not quite square there's 26 this way 29 that way and like I said I think it's just stunning absolutely beautiful once I get it into a little configuration here that works for me um, I'll hang it on a door doorway uh, and that will allow all of the leather to kind of fall into place I think that's probably good like that something like that oh it's just gorgeous <laughs> let me know if you have this bag guys I'm keen to hear who else has one um, and how it's holding up for you what are you using it for I'm um, yeah really not sure what to use it for I don't I almost don't want to take it out of the house of course you know what I mean just because it's so precious to me I absolutely adore it and again with the beautiful um, planner as well it's just such a beautiful combo I love it all so much it's so gorgeous thank you Havnichi for selecting me <laughs> I'm very happy to have this okay guys that's a quick one for me today just wanted to show you this beautiful bag um, I've been waiting for it to come for so long it was super fast when it did actually ship so thanks again that's awesome okay guys thanks so much for watching I'll see you all again super super soon bye